This is what it looks like when you open up a lithium-ion battery. There's plus, minus, and lithium ions. These M and M's go back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Charge and discharge, charge and discharge, charge and discharge. The lithium-ion battery. Dr. Chi Cha Hu, the CEO of EV battery startup SES, recently unveiled the world's largest lithium-ion battery. Compared to lithium-ion batteries, it's 30% more powerful, 18% cheaper, supports quick charging from 10% to 90% in 12 minutes, and offers a driving range over 900 kilometers. I know what you're thinking. You must be asking, isn't this too good to be true? Aren't those just samples? Actually, they're legit. With Hyundai Motor, SCS demonstrated that their lithium metal batteries do work. A Hyundai Motor driver drove a go-kart powered by SCS lithium metal batteries. The technology is real, they are no lot. SCS says its lithium metal batteries are the biggest one in the world. But what is a lithium metal battery anyway, and why does the size of it matter? When you open up a lithium metal battery, the minus side is a thin layer of metallic lithium. It's basically a bag of m and during discharge, these M&Ms break apart one by one and travel to the plus side. During charge, these M&Ms return to the minus side and reconstruct an M&M &M block. I know it doesn't make sense, right? But this is science. This is why lithium metal batteries were invented about 10 years earlier than lithium ion batteries but haven't been commercialized yet. To make a long story short, when lithium metal batteries are charged and discharged, the structure changes dramatically. The batteries shrink and swell constantly. To power electric vehicles, we have to make lithium metal batteries bigger and more powerful. And this is extremely challenging. Imagine 30 to 40 layers of M&Ms assemble and disassemble like transformers. This is why SES World's largest lithium metal batteries are touted as the game changer. But here's the question. Companies like SK On, Samsung SDI, and LG Energy Solutions are also developing lithium metal batteries. So how can a startup like SCS, which is less than 10 years old, compete against those giant battery companies? SCS says it's going to benchmark Tesla. Though Ford, BMW, Volkswagen, and Toyota make better cars, it's Tesla leading the EV market. Why? Because Tesla only focuses on EVs. No gasoline, no diesel, not. While LG, Samsung, and SK are spending billions of dollars for expansion, SES can solely concentrate on lithium metal batteries. This is a strategy. SES is building a gigafactory in Shanghai, and it will be completed by 2023. Let's wait and see how SES next generation lithium metal batteries will disrupt the EV market. And this is actually my first YouTube video. Interns did all the work, I'm just doing the voice. I don't know how to end this, so go watch Netflix or something. <laughs>